State University Uzarwe. On this host to guest program, I am your uncle Awi Amirian, and today we have a guest who happens to be the Dean of Faculty of Applied Health Science, Dr. Muhi Bin Musa Adenili. Good afternoon, sir. Good, good morning. Good morning, sir. We are glad. To... And listeners at home, good morning. Good morning, sir. We are glad to have you here, sir. Thank you. Okay, so sir, these programs are more like. So we can get to know your faculty better, get to know you better, and get to know your departments better. So can you tell us about yourself? Right. My name is uh, Musa Abidemi Nibi. I'm a medical laboratory scientist. Uh, I'm a fellow of Medical Laboratory Science Council of Nigeria and West Africa Postgraduate College of Medical Lab Science, Hematology Faculty. I'm the acting dean of Faculty of Applied Sciences, Edo State University, Uzaro. Sir, juggling all these positions together, do you find them taxable? Okay. Well, I've only mentioned a few. Because uh, nature has been powerful, you have to continue to use your skill positively to impact on the system, to impact on the society. So, combining those responsibilities they are just challenging, not uh, difficult at all. I'm the present, I'm presently the secretary of the Matology and Blood Transfer Science Society of Nigeria. Yes. Okay. So, when was your faculty accredited, and how many students did you guys start with? Initial visitation that is called uh, 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 resource verification, NUC. Then the Medical Lab Science Council of Nigeria. Later. The accreditation proper was uh, done because they also sent their team, both NUS and MLSA, and we scaled through all this, including us in two. We had the accreditation from both uh, and nursing care. And that is why nursing remains a profession that uh, people seek after everywhere across the globe. Same thing applies to medical lab science. Medical lab science is a profession that deals with analysis of body fluid, body waste, uh, body tissue to generate results that will be useful in establishing diagnosis of ailments, predicting if of ailments because it will mimic each other in terms of uh, symptoms or manifestation. Hi guys, so I just finished my program. It lasted for like 30 minutes or like 40 minutes i'm not sure oh yeah this is why i like my job i get to meet the big big people of the university do you get so we had an interview with faculty the dean of faculty of applied health science and it was really nice the man is actually very nice i enjoyed like the interview section and i took a picture with him so yeah I just this video was like unplanned for because i remember like i've not showed you guys like any of my radio program or like presentation program so I was just like okay why not but the video is not complete though but i think yeah, the video is not complete I, I think my space i don't know but the video is not complete so now judith has a program by 12 yeah she has a program by 12 so just going to go and support her support my girl support your girl you know so yeah bye guys i love you please like comment subscribe share turn on your post notifications do those good things you know and yeah i'll see you guys bye but we had a long day i'm talking too much like yeah i should stop okay, let me just tell you guys i had a long day i had a presentation in the morning then i had a radio program and my classes end by six the life of a freaking mass communicator so we're everywhere but that's fine bye guys I'm
wants to sit well with you. Let him jump on a regular basis and get to an increased risk of getting diseases like alcoholic, fatty liver diseases, and some cancers. Here with me today is a very special guest, a student like me who found passion in cooking. Please kindly introduce yourself. Supporting, supporting her girl. Me taking over the studio, cause catch me. Me, this is nice. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Sam, say hi to my vlog. Vegetable soup is 